Hi and welcome to this video log with me Wayne from SwimmingCyclingRunning.com Well, like all athletes you train very hard for something, you've got a mind as to what you want the result to be and as you're going through something things start to go wrong, what do you do? That's exactly what happened to Katrina Johnson Thompson in the heptathlon in the World Championships just at the weekend and it set me thinking, I mean she clearly saw things going wrong and still didn't adjust for the things that were going wrong and when you're an athlete when you're doing anything in life I think you've got to plan for things that might happen that you hope aren't going to happen as a coach I often say to someone what if this happens what if this happens in the swim what if in the cycle you have a puncture what happens if in the run you start getting blisters what happens if someone gets in your way what happens if you fall over and all those what-ifs are important things to consider before you actually start your main race. If you can, you want to practice things beforehand that get those what-ifs nailed so that you don't get floored by them when they actually happen. Because what-ifs do happen. And it happened to Katrina badly in that heptathlon when she was doing the long jump. Not, she, she knew after the first round that she hadn't got a qualifying jump so to me that was a what if all right I haven't got a qualifying jump in the first round but I know I'm jumping well put my start for the run back half a meter that might mean I'm 20 centimeters behind where I should be on the, on the actual takeoff block but if I'm 20 centimetres behind, I'm going to make an honest jump and I'm jumping well. I know I'm going to get a reasonable jump out of it. I'm going to score and I'm going to score reasonably well. Last round, I can absolutely go for it knowing I've got a real chance of a medal, even if that one fails. And that was a what if I think I'd have played um, if I was her coach. I'd have said, no, we've got to, we've got to score. The, the main thing is scoring. The second thing is scoring well. And that, to me, is hugely important for all of us athletes um, who try and do something. No matter whether you're going for a world championship or you're just trying to complete a, a sprint or an Ironman. What if my water bottle falls out of my cage? Do I stop and pick it up? Do I go on? If it's an Ironman, you almost certainly stop and pick it up. If it's a sprint, you might just say, OK, I'm just going to head, head on. I'm just not going to stop. I'm not going to waste my time. But I know it's happened to me. At the Blenheim Triathlon, um, I went over a bump. My bottle cage, bottle fell out of my bottle cage. What did I do? I picked it up because I'm not going to compete at the top end, and it didn't worry me. And with Katrina, I think it really came to the point of I can't believe this is happening. Well, if you'd practiced it beforehand, not only would you have believed it, you'd have actually had something in place to make sure you dealt with it the best way possible, and scoring nothing was not the best way possible. So plan for the what ifs. What if my goggles come off in a swim? What if someone swims over me? What if I feel like I'm panicking in the swim? Have a what if. Stop, go to a side, continue. Or do I say, okay, my race is over. It's up to you. Plan the what ifs beforehand. I've done this before, but it's so important. It happens again and again. Not planning for those silly what ifs that you really should have done. Okay, I feel sorry for her. I hope next time she'll have something in place that actually makes sure she'll get the best out of herself even if things aren't necessarily going her way. Okay, have a great week. See you next week. Keep up.